Hey guys, Rhino here. Welcome back to Friday Night Smackdown, episode number 100 of the 2K20 series. Pretty much episode 100 at least. I tried to get most of them out, some of them didn't quite make it through technical difficulties, but I'll say at least 90 of them have made it so far, and hopefully going forward there won't be any more issues. To celebrate the 100th episode of this series, we've got three matches coming up tonight, and two of them are title matches. We've got the King of Strong Style, Shinsuke Nakamura, defending the Intercontinental title against Ryback as the big guy finally gets his rematch for the IC title. And in the main event, we've got new Universal Champion Edge in his first title defence. And he's finally giving James Storm the opportunity he's been looking for for a very long time. However, if James Storm loses this match, he is barred from ever appearing on SmackDown ever again. Could still end up on Raw, but he'll never appear again on the blue brand we start the night with the women's tag match not for the tag team titles we've got Shayna Baszler and Nia Jax the women's tag team champions will be taking on tonight the team of Tamina and Natalia the plan match yet to come tonight in the 100th episode of this series and to leave a like if you've enjoyed the video leave a comment down below subscribe if you hit notification bell see you in any future videos you can follow on Twitter and Instagram that I'm much appreciated the link to the description down below. Thanks for watching. I hand over now to the in-game commentary. Enjoy these matches coming up tonight. And I'll see you all next time. Now that's not right. Somebody do something about that. In off the tag. Look at this. Nia Jax is letting everyone know exactly how she feels. Foot overhand chop. You got to feel for Tamina Snuka looking beaten down at this point. This is bad, guys. I don't even think she has enough power to get to her corner to make the tag. Really needs to get to the corner and make a tag. Otherwise, this match may be over sooner than later. Getting closer now. You don't get much closer than this, Michael. And gets the tag. is just insulting. Wow! Head crank! This is an incredible performance being put on by Nia Jax. The momentum is clearly turned to her favor. Contact there. And there's the tag. Tamina into the ring. Tamina Snuka giving a little South Pacific flavor right there. Oh, the face has been planted. Just striking at will. Oh, she's not looking good here. The first thing she needs to do is somehow get out of that corner. Headbutt. The shoulders are down. Dug down deep and gets the shoulder up. I'm impressed. Oh, that was some reversal by Tamina. Now we have Tamina on the attack. Tamina Snuka just barely got out of the way. Oh, what a right! Yeah, that's some attitude behind it. Shoulder right in the midsection. A striking blow. Producing a trampling. Tamina's feeling good about herself. We'll see if it lasts. The super kick for the victory here. One, two, uh, teammate makes the save. And just in time, comes in off the tag. And 
Shayna Baszler making her think twice. A nice shot by Shayna Baszler. Oh yeah. my God, what an elbow. Got the head scissors of mine. Oh, oh man, that's just nasty. Talk, malicious. Shayna hooked up. Whoa, oh my God. Look at this again, one more time. Just ragdolling her opponent. Bang! She's got the shoulders down. for comfort. Well, Natalia uses every bit of the strength she has left to survive. Not what she was looking for. Oh, look at this raining down sharp elbows. The impact. Looking to make a much needed tag here. And if successful, we may be looking at a whole new match here. combination and it's Natalia with the reversal whoa not so fast it might only be Hart keeping Shayna Baszler in this match she's got nothing left guys if she it could be over here there's the save Hooked up, and down! The Jinoku driver! And there's a taste of the confidence of Natalya. Double underhook applied. Butterfly suplex! We're gonna make the tag here. A tag at this point can change the whole complexion of the match, Michael. Looks like she's gonna make it, Corey! Yeah, but looks can be deceiving, Cole. You know that. There's the tag. Here we go. It's a whole new match now, fellas. And it's Natalya with the reversal. <laughs> Technical prowess from Nia Jax. An effective leg drop. Here's a cover. One, two, maybe not. Ooh, bullseye. And it's reversed. Paying for that mistake. in the midsection. That will get your attention. Desperately trying to get to the corner now. It's not going to be easy though, Michael. Almost there. So close, so close. Keep going, come on. And there's the... This could do it. One, two, near fall after near fall in this matchup here. She just will not go away. Natalia says, not this time. Punch in the arm. Not done yet. Into the arm breaker. Hammer lock. Oh! Shayna Baszler's got her opponent right where she wants her. And now latching on. Baszler, moments away, closing in on a submission win. Another big win perhaps coming for Baszler. And it's Natalya with the reversal. Absolutely planted. Stomping. Ouch. Natalia definitely has a few things to say about it. And 
Shayna Baszler evades that one. Absolutely has to make a tag here. Yeah, but that's easier said than done, Michael. She's getting closer, Corey. Yeah, but I'd hate to see what happens here if she doesn't make the tag. She makes the tag. And look at her partner go. And Shayna Baszler making her think twice. Nice armbar stretch. Very painful. That's how you punish your opponent. Hoping to end it here. What's it going to take to keep her down? Wow, I thought this was over. Shayna hooked up. Won't ever go. Look at this again one more time. Just ragdolling her opponent. Bang. She's going for the cover. Used up her last bit of energy. Spear! Spear! Desperately needs to make a tag here. I don't know, it's going to be tough to make it to the corner. First on the shoulders. Ooh. Fortress submission. Shane and Baszler roughing it up. She's fighting hard and reaping the rewards. Oh, that was some reversal by Tamina. Oh, right to the throat. And Shayna Baszler evades that one. Sidewalk slam. Cover here. One, what is keeping this competitor going? Yeah, and Tamina Snuka digs deep, doing her family proud. Baszler with the underhook. Here it comes. There's the save. How close was that? Knee left. Roundhouse kick. The Queen of Spades is lighting her up. So dangerous. Now it's Tamina Snugger. Goodness, that looked bad. What a gutsy performance from Tamina. Look at this. She better have a good reason for this. Up and down. What a slam. Up and boom. Knee drop right on target. Tamina's feeling good about herself. We'll see if it lasts. Oh, what a combo! Boom, just relentless! Going after her midsection again. And can you blame her? It practically has a target on it at this point. Looking stunned. Looking rocked. Where's the tag? Opponent off the ropes. Oh, catastrophic damage on the back. Tamina unleashing primal rage. Dictating the pace of the match now. It could be over here. This is it. Display. Now let's take a look back at these ladies in action.
the ring announcer. This one's over. And here's your winner. I got a feeling they're going to be talking about this win for a while. And it's matches like this one that makes SmackDown such a success. Thank you so much for joining us. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. And is for the WWE Intercontinental Championship. As we get started here, let me remind everybody that the title is on the line here tonight. Yeah, but that's just a mere formality. The way I see it, there is no way we crown a new champion tonight. But it's going to take the performance of a lifetime to walk out of here as champion. And I think he knows that, Michael. If anybody's up for the task, it's certainly him. warrior some might say those mind games that sinister like attitude represents the true personality of Shinsuke Nakamura a man who feels he has freed himself from the weight of the WWE Universe of the highly coveted Intercontinental Championship. Its holder is frequently considered by many as the hardest working champion in all of sports entertainment. The WWE Intercontinental title on the line. Perhaps a new chapter will be written in this championship's long history. For over 40 years, the WWE's best have competed for this title. Winning the Intercontinental title has been a major milestone in some Hall of Fame careers, and well, it could be just that again here tonight. Dropkick hits the mark. Set up for the side rushing leg sweep. That's how you stop your opponent. Ooh, earth shattering spine buster. Oh, he's got him up high. The fall away slam. 
Picking up speed. Oh, splash! Nakamura seems to have lost a step now. No need to panic. He's still swinging. Oh, what a really great swinging neck breaker. Shinsuke Nakamura called himself the artist, and it's plain to see why. From his theatrical entrance to his unorthodox movement in the ring, almost everything about Nakamura could be put in a museum. Well, except for his cheap shot low blows. He's been quickly taking control here. He's hitting on all cylinders right now. Look at this! Ah, oh, the reversal by Shinsuke Nakamura. Oh, a front thrust kick. Hit the mark with that one. He might have been waiting on that one. And again, yet another counter. There it is, he's locked in. Smart maneuver. This could be it. Nicely done as he gets out of the submission. Color me surprised, Michael. I did not see that one coming. When the WWE Intercontinental Championship rolls around, you know the superstars are going to be fired up. Set those DVRs, folks. 12 to 6 elbows over and over again. Oh, absolutely punishing. Shinsuke Nakamura with a nice reversal. Bang right in the face. KO punch. Guys, Shinsuke Nakamura taking full advantage. So dangerous. Oh, well, Ames. The champion into the cover. Get an easy kick out. Oh, wow. Going back to the artist known as Shinsuke Nakamura. We've also seen many a masterpiece in the ring from Nakamura during his time in NXT and on SmackDown Live. Unfortunately, he's tarnished that reputation by resorting to cheap tactics nowadays. Look, he's still an artist in my eyes. Unbelievable. This singles match is over. We got our money's worth with that one. Take a look. Impressive showing there and route to the win. We knew it would take the performance of a lifetime, and that's exactly what we got. Wow. There's your new champion, ladies and gentlemen. Guys, I've literally got chills after watching that thrilling championship match. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. And is for the WWE Universal Championship. It's a big-time opportunity, Byron, as the title will be on the line here. You're right, Michael, and judging from the response on social media heading into this match, we're likely to see a new champ crown here tonight.
Edge has accomplished everything in his career. I mean, you go back to, to Edge's childhood where he, uh, he won an essay contest to win the right to train inside the ring for the first time. And since then, of course, creating a Hall of Fame career here in WWE. The ultimate opportunist. Introducing the challenger from Knoxville, Tennessee, weighing in at 220 pounds, James Storm. And introducing the champion from Toronto, Ontario, Canada, weighing in at 249 pounds, he is the WWE Universal Champion, the Rated R Superstar. Winning the Universal title makes you the guy in WWE. The top title of WWE's flagship brand the Universal title is on the line right now. Lesnar, Goldberg, Reigns, Rollins, some big names have made this title prestigious in short order, gentlemen. Edge oh, gathering attention in a hurry. And Edge is begging him to bring it here. Suplex, very effective. Spin kick! I'd say Edge just turned the tempo up. Things are really going his way now. The WWE Universe has been with Edge since the beginning. So when the Rated R Superstar turned into the ultimate opportunist, fans were not too pleased as Edge happily carried out one despicable act after another. Drop. Measured. Boom! Knee drop. Wow. Edge just timed that perfectly. Edge with a rough blow there. The challenger eating up some damage. He planned for this and can still rally. Face first. Left. Covered by the champ. He's got plenty of gas left in the tank. Oh, man, I don't know who to root for. When you hear the deafening sea of booze from the WWE Universe, it's important to point out that Edge is quite proud of himself. No one appreciates his conduct as a master manipulator. Well, except for Edge himself. It's been well documented over the years that Edge will stoop to any depths to get what he wants. To make matters worse, the Rated R Superstar doesn't care who's hurt along the way. Edge is a sadistic individual. Punch after punch after punch. Oh, foot just stomping down. Four. Back now inside the ring. To have the slightest chance of success against the Rated R Superstar, you have to keep your cool. Edge has so much experience and is such a talented competitor, he can use the smallest laps in judgment against you. Throat. And he's out of there in a nick of time. I don't know what he has planned out here, but he must be mindful of the referee's count.
It's champion's advantage. The title cannot change hands by countout or disqualification. Shoulders down now. Is it enough to retain the championship? And another kick out. Just powered out. To your point, Corey, a superstar must keep their composure when going up against the rated R superstar edge. This is a decorated champion. It becomes more dangerous in a match as the stakes become higher. Edge is the master manipulator for a good reason. An opponent must be ready for Edge's mind games and the fact that he has the poise to wait until you make a mistake. Then the Rated R Superstar seizes the opportunity to capitalize. No, that's not right. Somebody do something about that. The challenger is Spear! Can it be? Will the rain continue? Now Edge needs to capitalize on that. Let's take a look at why Edge is the ultimate opportunist. championship match it was, ladies and gentlemen. Thanks for joining us.